Today, we're pretending to be really tired in Roblox so that we can skip out on school. But the problem is our mom won't let us go to sleep. Oh, I'm tired. She keeps asking us to do chores. But you know what's not a chore? Watching our videos. So check and see if you're subscribed right now. And if you're not, click that button to get goaded. Bro, the bus driver for school ditched me. And I'm so tired. I think I need more sleep. Let me go talk to mom. Yo, listen to my feet. <laughs> I sound like I got flippers on. I was gonna say, bro, you sound like a cartoon character. What the heck? Yo, my mom is a giant. Hold on, let's talk. Hi, mom. Can I please go to bed? No. Please? Do your chores, then you can. Fine, I'll do my chores. Also, Sonny, it's not that your mom's giant. It's just that you're a kid, so you're super small. Yeah, but I'm like the tiniest kid ever. I'm like two feet tall. Mm -hmm. You are a child, after all. Whatever, bro. I got my mop. It's time to do some cleaning. What am I mopping? up lego blocks what am i mopping don't tell me this is water that was water it was just a square it's a big square of water it looks like lego blocks here we go clean that water up Ooh, let me inspect this hmm yo i got a badge this is pretty interesting it's a self-portrait of me as a baby i was gonna say it's, it's a selfie bro Ooh, i is big brain me so smart wait what why am i so smart what did i do what what big head ending wait you found an ending already sonny bro i just unlocked a secret ending okay turns out this is not the same is the other need more heat and need more cold games. I guess you can reach endings pretty fast on this one. Okay, Melon. I got the mop again and it's time to clean up this water. Yo, wait, what? Can I clean it? Uh, I think that's just a bath mat. Obviously, Sonny. <laughs> Imagine if I mopped up the bathtub. You gotta mop up the water in the living room. Oh, yeah. Once I clean this up, it causes another flood over here and I'm not inspecting this photo. Nope. Yeah, dude. You don't want to get the big head ending again. Nah. I want to find more Ogwa to clean up. But maybe that's everything. Talk to mom. Nope. It still says mop up the floor under the objectives. So there's got to be another puddle. Got it. Bro, how did you not notice that? Do I dare check this book? Uh, just go talk to mom, Sonny. All right. All right. Let's see what mama's got to say. Hey, big mama. Phew. Done removing the water. Okay. Can I please sleep now? I'm tired. Mm, fix the shelves. Bruh. Sonny, you're not getting off that easily. You got plenty more chores to do before you can sleep. Yeah, but why am I even asking? here. Why don't I just go to bed? What's she gonna do if I'm already sleeping? Mm, she will kill you, Sonny. Whoa. Chill. Look what I found. Summon the fire, dude. Wait, don't summon the fire, bro. You don't want to get the fire ending. Let's just get the real ending for once. Okay, let me fix all the bookshelves. But where? Where do I fix them? Right there. You just did it. Oh, I just walk into it? Yeah, bro. There you go. What about the shopping list, Melon? Juice, water, and chips. Should I pick it up? Uh, sure, but just go talk to mom, bro. Bro, there's no way these can all all be secret endings. That'd be crazy. There we go. I got the shopping list for later. But now your objective changed to tell mom about the shopping list. Whoa, you right, bruh. Maybe I could do the shopping ending. What is this for, mom? Oh, yeah, I want you to go shopping. Seriously? You have never asked me to go shopping before. You must do it, Sonny. Even though it's ridiculously late, you have no choice. I'm just capping and telling her I'm done. Okay, cool. May I please sleep now? How about nah? Seriously? Clean your toys. Bro, I swear, my mom is crazy. Well, it looks like I got the glitched ending because I can't move. Can I reset my character? No. My only option is to leave the game. <sighs> <laughs> oh my goodness, Sonny. For once, can we just do this game how it's supposed to be played? Hold on. Maybe if I type something like this TT thing. No, no. Okay, I'm glitched. Well, found the glitch ending, everybody. This is great. Okie dokie. So we're back to fixing the bookshelves. And this time, I am not picking up the shopping list. I'm not going to touch the TV remote. I'm doing nothing of the sort. We're following the main storyline. So I talked to mom and she wants me to clean up my toys. All I want to do is sleep. Sonny, you see those blocks over there? Just grab them. All right, I'm cleaning them up slowly. It's one of these games where you just hold the E button for all of eternity. How many of these am I gonna have to pick up? There's like 20 of these Lego bricks scattered throughout the house. Oh, great. <laughs> yep, you're gonna have to do quite a bit of Eing. E, 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 e. Is that how you do it? Yes, yeah, something like that. Or you just hold down E on your keyboard. I think my version is better here. Let me try it again. E, 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 e,
Hey. See, it worked way faster now. All right, Sunny. Every time you have to do E from now on, please start screaming. Really? You mean it? I can scream as loud as I want? Yeah, do it. All right. Well, I don't have to do that right now. Oh, wait. I do. Talk to mom. Press E. E. Oh, my goodness, Sunny. My eardrums. Yo, I'm just trying to sleep. Nah, not yet. What do I need to do now? No, your homework. But it's due in 323 years. Uh, still, the earlier, the better. But I need more sleep. Bruh, imagine 323 years till your homework is due. Yeah, bro, you would be very old. You'd probably be dead by then. What if these people can live forever? Wait, you're right. I never thought of that. And oh no, Melon. It says I have to press E! Oh, you gotta hold that high note though, Sonny. Nah, I'm not holding it. This homework is taking too long. I will break my vocal cords and I'm pretty sure people would unsubscribe to our channel. Yeah, but it would be so funny. Whatever. I'm just solving one plus one equals window. Do, do, do. Hello, mother. I have completed E. That was hard. You really can't solve one plus one? Well, well, well it's hard. You're in grade nine, dumb. Dumbo? Yeah, you can call me Dumbo. Anyways, can I sleep? Nah. Dude, now what? What are the plans? in our garden outside, please. See, even the character wants me to yell loud and make weird noises. I can feel it coming, Melon. Oh, no. Sonny, what even is this, bro? What am I looking at? Clearly, this is a watering can. Bro, it's absorbing your face. Where's your head? I am in the watering can because I have to fill it up with my saliva. Like, toop, toop, and then I spit it on the plants. That is actually disgusting. Well, I don't know what else I'm doing here, bro. I'm just pressing E. Okay, I got to stop. Guys, comment down below if I should stop yelling the letter E. Or also comment if you're enjoying it. Wait, no, don't tell me. I got to do more. Oh, my goodness, Sonny. How many times? do you have to do this? I don't know, but can you please tell us about how much you love games where you just hold down a button and wait? I love holding down E. It's my favorite thing in the world. Bro, I gotta do it three times. I probably have to do it four times. Sonny, I think you're missing something to actually press E. Oh, wait, you're right. It says go talk to mom on the objectives. What the heck? Bro, you just wasted all your time, Sonny. Whatever. Let me see what mama wants. Hello, mom. Finally complete. Lol. What do you mean, lol? May I sleep now? Uh, nah, you got a few more chores to do. Lol. Lord, have mercy upon my... For real. For real, for real, now what? For real, for real, now what? Feed your hamster. I have a hamster? I didn't even know I had a hamster. Where is he? Maybe I can offer him to the fire dude. Um, hmm, where is hamster? Right there. Bob. <laughs> no way, bro. They keep making this thing slower and slower. Bro, you know you love doing this. This is cringe. Hey, Bob got fed. Time to talk to mom. Bob seemed happy. Cool, B. Anyway. Can I sleep? Beep, 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 beep. No. Bro, what next, mom? Plunge the toilet. Oh, bro. Bro, what if a skibbity comes out of the toilet while I'm plunging? That might happen, Sonny. Be very careful. I don't even have a plunger in my hand. I'm gonna just do this with my fists? Gross. Wait a second. What if I'm plunging it with my head like a giant swirly? Oh, wait. I canceled it. Oh, no. Do, 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 do. Just plunging toilets with my face. You've got this, Sonny. You could also eat the the water to make it go faster. Uh, yeah, I should have put a straw in there. You're right. You're very correct. Anyways, let me talk to mom. Can I sleep? Uh, shut down the radiators. Otherwise, no sleepy. Oh my goodness, I... Watch your language, young man. I didn't say anything. I was gonna say I fun. It's super fun shutting down the radiators. Oh, wait. These are actually fun. I don't have to hold the I just press it. That is pretty fun, Sonny. Oh, thank goodness. This is how it should always be coded. One little click. Do you do you, do you, do you, do you. Hello, mother. C -c 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 can I sleep now? Mm, let me think. Mm, I've decided that. What have you decided, mom? Please tell me. You can. No way. I get to sleep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good ending. Oh, that sound was terrible. <laughs> All right. Bro, stop yelling at me. I get it. Sonny, we got the good ending. And you guys should all like and subscribe right now. Yeah, and I gotta leave this game. I'm tired of hearing this. Oh! And if you guys need more sleep, just press that like button because you don't want to get caught sleeping on our channel. Today, Sonny and I play the sleepover experience. Pretty much, we go to sleepover at our friend's house. We're chilling out watching TV, but then we hear breaking news. An evil uncle is on the loose. And guess who's coming over to the sleepover? Our friend's uncle. Uncle. What does he want from us? Who knows? All I do know is that it's not good. Comment down below what you think this uncle is up to. Hey, Melon, welcome to the sleepover. There's no way our friend
friend invited us over. Look how rich he is. Bro, and cool. Check out his backwards cap. Hey, yo, that's how you know he's cool with it. Oh, he's gonna show us around? Bro, he's got a modern mansion. Yeah, bro. That's actually so sick. Objective. Follow your friend. Why was it so scary, bro? All we're doing is following this guy. Yeah, I don't know. It's really weird that it's so scary. Melon, why am I locked out? Oh, just follow us, Sonny. He's just showing us around the place. I know. I'm here. I'm right behind you. This is the living room? Okay, way to flex your TV on us. You had to tell me about how huge it is. <laughs> bro, it's not just a big screen TV. It's a cozy home theater. Yo, is this guy lagging or is it just me? Nah, he's waddling. Bro, he's moonwalking. This is where we can get the late night snacks. Yeah, you wish you had a kitchen like this, Sonny. Nah, I'm just gonna collect all the toy soldiers. How do I get the one out by the pool, though? Bro, you're about to jump scare me. Don't even try to jump scare me. No, look, I want to get that little toy soldier. Bro, you just go out here, pick up the lantern. Melon, I just saw you look at the lantern and the pay to win head. I don't know what you're talking about, Sonny. I don't know what you're talking about. I would never do such a thing. Whatever. I'm following our friend to the garage. Oh, another toy soldier. Yo, that's actually true, bro. I thought there'd be a supercar, but he's got like a poop mobile. His super, super Lamborghini is in the repair shop. Uh, Sonny, I think I ruined his audio. Yes, let's continue the tour. I want to see what else you have. But of course, Sonny. Following our friend upstairs. Hopefully this is where the video games are. Yeah, bro. So far, he's just showed us all the boring stuff. Yeah, what do you think's behind this door? Uh, his bedroom, obviously. He's about to show us this. Check it out. Okay, Melon, don't touch anything here. Except for the toy soldier. Give me that. Bro, there's another one right there, Sonny. Can you go get it, please? Yeah, I'll just grab it through the window. Ah! Ah! What was that? What was that? <laughs> I got him good, Sonny. Yeah, but I found another toy soldier at least. That was so scary. I don't know how you did that. Stop! Okay, I'll stop. I'll stop. <laughs> oh, that's funny. We're supposed to be checking out where we're having a sleepover, bro. Check it out, dude. There's four beds ready for a slumber party. You're right, Sonny. I can't wait. I dibs this one with the rubber ducky. Bro, wait. Does something look weird about that rubber ducky to you? Let me see. Ah! <laughs> oh, it's so good. Melon, if you do that again, oh, uh, I'm not going to react to it anymore. Okay, okay. I won't be scared. I, I won't be scared. I won't be scared. What's in the toy box, Melon? Why don't you take a look down there? All right, I'm done, Sonny. I'm done jump scaring. Once you buy it once, you can just spam it forever. Bro, that is cringe. That's it. Grab all the toys. I'm going to collect the rocket ship and the creepy FNAF doll. There we go. And over by the pool, what is this? There's a toy gun. I'm going to use this on the bad guy. Yo, we're going to need that, Sonny, because if he's a bad guy from our imagination, we're gonna need imaginative tools to take him out. Well, it wasn't imaginary. It was a real gun. Oh, are you serious? Yeah, very, very serious. Now, can you do me a favor and return these items to the toy box? Okay, yeah, so hold E on the toy box eight times. And I'll collect this gold toy soldier. Bro, this isn't fun, dude. He's just making us do chores. Actually, this is chore simulator. I forgot to tell you that. Bro, but this isn't a sleepover. Whoa. Check out the toy box, bro. When you place them in, it looks awesome. Take a closer look. Wow, Sonny, that's so crazy. Ah! <laughs> what is wrong with you? Revenge! Stop doing it, Sonny. So or I'll start doing it, and then we won't even be able to play the game. Stop doing what? Stop doing what? Stop doing what? Stop doing what? Stop it! I'm not doing anything. <sighs> Bruh. Let's listen to our backwards hat friend, okay? Let's see what's playing on television. I bet you it's gonna be some bad news about the neighborhood being attacked by this guy. Stop. Oh my goodness, Sonny. Ooh, toy soldier. You're right, Sonny. It is this guy. A <laughs> dangerous uncle. Yo, it is that guy. He's kidnapping kids. And they're never seen again, Melon. I don't want to be one of those kids. Then we must stay inside the house and chill with the homie. All right, I'm gonna stay safe. Bro, this guy guy is creepy. He said stay inside the house. Remember that, Sonny. Hold on. I just gotta go grab something from outside really quick. No, Melon, Melon, this is important. Our friend recognized the person from the news. The creepy uncle. Wait, actually, bro? On some other good news, I found a golden toy soldier. Nice. We just need two more. But I have a bad feeling that might be our friend's dad. Or our uncle. I think we'd know if it was our uncle. Well, his uncle. Because he said uncle on the loose. Melon, we need to build a pillow fort with 45 pillows. Are you kidding me? What even is that? What even is that? Are you serious? We gotta do this 45 times? Who makes these games? What is wrong with them? At least... Ah! 
Bro, I just found the scary uncle in a pillowcase. Uh, did you actually, Sonny? No way. Ah, stop. You did it first. Yeah, but you deserved it. Why? Why did I deserve it? I don't know. It just sounds like you deserve it. Bro, I cannot believe this is really the game. Click on pillows 45 times. We did it, Sonny. We did it. And then hide. Look how cool these forts are. Look how cool it is. Melon. It's cool and all, but the power just went out. I'm gonna hide in the pillow fort, Sonny. I'm scared. You stay inside the pillow fort. I'll check outside with our friend Arino. No, he's scared, bro. You gotta go outside alone. I can do this. I'm not afraid of anything. Do, do, do. Restarting the power. Nothing suspicious here. And Melon, I swear if you use the jump scare. I'm not gonna use the jump scare, Sonny. Don't worry. Okay, I'm trying to repair the power. This is a careful task. I need to be extra cautious and... What the heck was that? No, 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 no. That was creepy. That sound effect was so weird. Bro, that scared me. What was that, Sonny? Melon, stop doing that! Yeah. That's it. I'm grabbing this toy soldier. Yo, our homie wants to play hide and seek. He's gonna hide and we have to find him. I don't trust him, bro. I have a really bad feeling, Sonny. He's gonna go missing and die. Yeah, that's probably right. But in the meantime, at least I'll get the last toy soldier. Let's go! All right, we gotta find our friend. I'm checking the backyard. I'm gonna check the garage. Melon? <laughs> I found him. Did you actually? Tag. Yeah. Wait, is he hiding all four rounds? I'm not telling you where. Yeah, dude. We gotta find him again. He's gonna move. Oh, Sonny, I've got a bad feeling about this. Dude, he just hid behind the next tree. I still see him outside. Are you serious? Yeah, look, I got him. Bro, this guy is trash at hiding. He needs to watch some more Sonny and Melon videos. For real. Then he'll know the goaded hiding spots. But let's see if his third try is any better. Is he still outside, Sonny? I'm checking the side of the house. Why don't you check the interior? I am, bro. He's not in the pillow fort. He's not upstairs. He might be inside. Yes. Maybe he's in the pool. No, no, Sonny, he's he's definitely inside. Bro, he should have at least turned the lights out in the kitchen before standing up there. Bro, he's actually the worst at hide and seek. Sonny, I've got a really bad feeling about next round. Nah, he's not gonna go missing, bro. Everything's cool. I think we're only gonna find his head in the pillow fort. That's actually a great idea. I'll go check upstairs. Do, 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 do. Is he hiding in here? Bro, he's not even hiding up here. That would have been smart. Uh, Sonny, I've got a really bad feeling about this round. Round. He's probably just in the garage. No, he's not. It's not outside. Do you see him anywhere? No, I don't see him here, Sonny. Oh, I found him. He's outside. Maybe I can tag him through the wall. Wait, are you serious? Nothing happened? We were just actually playing hide and seek? Yeah, bro. He was just outside the kitchen. He's bored of hide and seek. He wants to play a new game. Ah! Sonny! Sorry, sorry. I thought we were playing a new game. Dang it, bro. You can't do that. Just answer the phone. I can't yet. Oh, let me pick it up. There we go. Uh... They sound friendly. Uh-oh. Bro, his uncle's coming over. Do you think it's the same uncle from the news? Wait, you mean this guy? Yo, stop! You almost gave me a heart attack. Hide before uncle arrives. Sonny, is his uncle gonna kill us? I don't know, but I'm gonna hide inside of the pillow fort. Oh, you can't. You have to hide under the bed, Sonny. Dang it. Well, I'm gonna hide under the one that had the rubber duck. And I'm gonna live. I'm definitely gonna live. Will we survive? There he is. Look at him with his strut, bro. Oh my goodness, he's levitating. What is the uncle doing? Uh-oh, Sonny. Why is he asking these types of questions? It's kind of weird. Uh-oh, Sonny. This is not good. Jake, don't rat us out. Thank you, Jake. He had our back. Kind of nervous for Jake. I think he's getting kidnapped by his uncle. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bruh, my heart's pounding. This sleepover's creepy. Oh, no, Sonny. He's gonna kidnap him. But maybe we can save him after. Oh no, he's dragging Jake. <laughs> Help! Help! We gotta save Jake. Oh no, Sonny. How could this guy do that? We have to rescue Jake. It's the only way. Okay, Sonny, we've gotta do something about this. Let's investigate. Secret basement. Bro, what the heck? Check the rooms. We need to find Jake, Sonny. Bro, why are there secret rooms under here? This feels like a dungeon. Yeah, this does not feel right. Yeah, just look everywhere, Melon. We can also abandon Jake. If we want to. No, we're not going to do that. It's, uh, it's just this way to abandon Jake. And then we'll survive. No, Melon, that's pure evil. I will save Jake. Ah! What is that sound? Uh, I don't know, Sonny, but I did not like it. it. Sounded like pots and pans falling. Okay, let's just check out the next room. I kind of want to go back for the lantern. I want to be able to see better. I'm scared. All right, I'm checking this next room. There's nothing in here. Wait, what the heck was that? I don't know. I'm coming back with a lantern so we can see. We're going in. No sign of Jake, Sonny. Just weird noises and creepy. Creepy old furniture. He's got to be in one of these. Come on. Jake. Jake, we're looking for you, bro. 
Bro, what is this place? Wait a second. Melon, what if Jake's in on it? No, there's no way Jake's in on it, Sonny. He would have kidnapped us earlier. Oh, yeah, you're right. Why would he lie for us? Uh, Sonny? Oh, this is what he does to the kids he kidnaps. He puts them in sand. But it isn't Jake. Jake could still be alive. Bro, this is weird. It's like he's turning them into kitty litter. Yeah, I don't like it at all. Therefore, we must go deeper into the basement, Melon. It's the only way. We are going deeper. Ah! Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go, Melon. We've gotta run, Sonny. We've gotta run. Oh, oh, his uncle's gonna try and get us. Just follow the arrows. And his loud breathing is giving me the creeps. Bro, I feel like I'm in Rainbow Friends. Where is he? I don't see him yet, Melon. We should be fine. Yeah, we should be all right. Ah, run! <laughs> Run! Run! Don't look back! Oh, that was a close one. We need to unlock this hatch, though, if we're gonna escape. There's a couple of hiding spots, though. Yeah, I think we should escape through the exit. All right, Sonny, you run. I'm gonna hide and look for Jake. But how do I run? I can't... Okay, I'm escaping. I'll hide, Sonny. Escaped ending! You hid from the uncle and escaped after he couldn't find you. Let's go. Okay, let me in the closet to hide. Why am I just staring at the closet? Oh, I think I'm gonna die, Sonny. I think my game glitched. It thinks I'm in the closet, but I'm not really there. As long as you held E. Oh, uh, Sonny. I can hear him breathing. Melon, are you okay? Are you gonna survive? I don't know, Sonny. I can hear him breathing behind me, but I can't do nothing. What's happening? I just hear big breaths and I'm staring at a closet. I can't move my camera at all. Oh, oh no. He's at my closet right now, but he walked away. What ending did you unlock? I didn't get an ending, Sonny. He's walking away now. He's gone. I got the survived ending. You hid from the uncle and escaped after he couldn't find you. Nicely done, bro. You did it. But did you save Jake? Nope, I did not. I guess we'll have to save him in part two. And if you goats want to see that, just make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. Guys, Santa has become evil. Something happened to him. Now everyone's on his naughty list. Will Sonny and I be able to survive? Melon, we're at the North Pole, and it's our job to save the holidays. The only thing is, the local newspaper said there's a killer out on the loose. Bro, we're fine, dude. We got Santa to protect us. Yeah, I really hope so, bro. At least one of his elves just came through. What's up, bro? What are you trying to buy from our store today? Anything? Yeah, we got uh, some good blocks, flakes, comedios. Uh, that's about it. He didn't even grab anything. What is he gonna give us at the counter? Oh, uh, he wants some candy. That makes sense, actually. Here you go. We'll charge you $14.99 for that. Yep, we got you. Don't even worry, bro. You want some floppa chips? You want some Cheetos, Doritos, Cheetos, floppa chips? That's all we got. Dude, I'll take some floppa chips. Those sound delicious. We also have pet food. Food. Ew. What the? Yeah, why would I want that next to my chips? Mmm, I don't know. Maybe your cat's hungry. I only feed my cats watermelon. <laughs> why are you feeding your cats watermelon? First of all, that doesn't even fit their nutritional diet, Sonny. They're carnivores. They can't eat watermelons. Nah, my cats are built different. No, bro. Cats aren't vegetarian. You're right. They're fruitarian. Bro, you're literally murdering your cats and you're murdering watermelons. Why are you doing that? Nah, bro. Relax. It's not that serious. First, I barbecue the watermelon to turn it into meat. What? Why are you barbecuing watermelons? You never done that, bro? You put a little barbecue sauce on it. You stick it on the grill. It gets delicious, bro. Tastes just like a steak. Bro, that actually sounds disgusting. No cap. Whatever. Just run the cash register. Yes, I got you. Don't worry, dude. I wonder what the next objective's gonna be. Same here, bro. What does that sound? It sounded like an alien ship. It really did sound like an alien. I think they abducted all of our food. <laughs> We've got to restock the shelves now. Bruh, what, how do you even restock this? Okay, here we go. It's your favorite activity. Hold E. I love holding E. I love when they put the cooldown for holding E to like five seconds. Isn't it satisfying? No, it's not. And now, Melon, you get to ring up more customers. And, and this person just flopped over on their face. What the heck? Hey, yo. I'm gonna scout what's outside of Bloxy Foods. So far, we got a snowman with some Christmas gifts. That looks kind of cool. What else is going on out here? Ooh, a vending machine. Let me get that. What would you like today, ma'am? Probably candy. Yep, it's always candy. I got you. Chill. Melon, everything seems to be in order outside. I don't see anything suspicious, except this snowman. Why is he hiding behind these rocks? And what's back here in the dumpster? Well, trash. Just trash. Good news, though, Melon. I found an energy drink. Time for me to zoom. Bro, I go 
so much faster now. Bro, how'd you find an energy drink? Was that free? Nah, I had to pay 25 Robux. Check this out. I can push him around. Hey, you talking to me, bud? Hey, you talking to me? He just called our place a mess, and he said he's gonna be talking to the health inspector. Well, I'm gonna be talking to Santa, and I'm gonna get you fired! That's right. Now get out of our store. Ah, uh, we gotta clean up, bro. Dude, I love how this trash just appeared out of nowhere. It manifested itself. I think the elf was so angry, he used some Christmas magic to pollute our shop. Oh, they are the worst, Sonny. Magical bad customers. I just hate them. Yeah, especially when they got pointy elf ears. Well, at least the store's already cleaned up. That was pretty quick. Wait, why is Freddy Fazbear here? I don't know, Sonny. They've got some interesting clientele. I'm gonna go check out what's back here in storage, make sure there's nothing sus. Uh, Melon, we have a problem. Uh, what's the problem, Sonny? I'll tell you about it after you ring up that customer. Yeah, I, I'm just ringing them up real quick. All right, and I'll head back to the storage. What is up, dog? The problem is we don't have enough beans to last us all Christmas. And someone got their head chopped off. What? Everyone's on the naughty list this year. Oh, you're next. Ho, ho, ho. What the heck? News. Santa has gone crazy. Incidents occurred at Santa's workshop located at the North Pole. Authorities recommend staying inside this Christmas due to reports of murderers in the city. Santa has become naughty. Oh, no. Uh, Sonny, what's this customer saying? I don't know. Oh, no. They seem kind of cursed. Uh, do you just want your food or are you just... Okay. Okay, we're chilling. We're chilling. Yeah, everything's fine. We're chilling. We're chilling. Ah! <laughs> What is wrong with you? I'm on the naughty list as well. Bro, I hope Santa murders you. Whoa, chill. He might he might murder you then. No, he's gonna murder you. Nah, bro. He's gonna just slap you with a snowball. I place the order. We're just gonna ignore the head and take the order out to the car. I'm heading back to the van and uh, here you go, buddy old pal. Everything you ordered is right here. Oh, they left. That was it. Oh, I thought this was Santa. Oh, thank goodness it's not Santa. We're okay. Santa Claus is coming to kill you and rip that melon off your head! What happened to my head? No, no, Santa's gonna take it from you. No, bro. Can't touch my cap. I just got this back. Bro, these customers, we've had enough of you guys. Just go home for the holidays. Yeah, jeez Louise, my dude. Freddy Fazbear's back. Yep, just keep on taking orders, sonny. Keep on taking them. Let me explore outside again. See if there's anything sus that's changed. What is this? Guys, do you see this? Look inside of that tree. Zoom in. Enhance. It looks like a subscribe button. Press that right now to get goaded. This guy was kind of rude. He just said, charge me now. All right, fine. Chill. You could do it faster, but thanks, I guess. Bro, I did it in like a record time. Melon, pick up the pace. We need to get a mop and clean up the floors. That's why I am zooming. Give me this mop. Bro, why is this mop so heavy? It takes forever to grab it. Ugh. Guys, Sonny, this game is annoying. Well, I just cleaned up the first puddle. I'll get this one. Get these ones over here. Good work, Melon. Just a couple more puddles of water to mop up and the floors will be sparkling clean. Yep, yep, yep. I really hope Santa doesn't come in and murder us. That would suck. Nah, bro. He won't do it. He tried to get us with some snowballs, but they all melted before we slipped. Either way, I'm gonna take this trash out to the dumpster. I hope I don't get murdered out there. All right, you look out for Santa Claus. I'm gonna stay really close behind you. Melon, you're going the wrong way. No, you gotta go this way if you don't want to get murdered. Oh, yeah, true. You take the long way around. Never mind. There's an invisible wall. Why? That is so annoying. Time for me to go fast. Brr, can you just do the trash. Yeah, yeah. Ah, what the heck? I ran straight into him. He killed me. Wait, he killed you, bro? What are you talking about? I got the dead ending. I was too quick with it. I ran straight into him. Bro, I don't even see him. I'm just gonna dump the trash. I can't believe that happened to me. Anywho, I'm Bing Chiling. What do I do? Took the trash to the dumpster, and now I gotta restock the shelves. How did you die, Sonny? I don't understand. <sighs> I was running super fast because I drank an energy drink, and I went right into San Santa Claus, and he killed me. Wait, like he popped up, but you ran into him? Yes. <laughs> I don't even think that's meant to happen. I think you glitched the game. I got the secret dead ending. Wait, it's a secret ending? No, it didn't. It just said you're dead. Bro, you are an idiot. Or am I a speedrunner? Ever think of it that way? Bro, I mean, I guess you're kind of speedrunning, but kind of messed up big time. Whatever. Just share your screen to me over Discord. I want to see what's happening. I'm just restocking the shelves, Sonny. Not a whole lot has happened, bro. It's a pretty peaceful life now that you're gone. Uh, well, I guess that after Santa Claus killed me, he's taking a break. Yeah, bro. I just gotta keep ringing up customers. Bro, this is Cash Register Simulator. It feels very 
authentic. It does feel authentic, bro. Everyone orders the same thing. Everyone's rude to you. You hate your job. And then Santa's also trying to murder you at the same time. No, he's trying to murder you. It's different. He's trying to murder me? Yeah, it's not the same thing. What's different about it? Because when you get murdered, you get sent to a new lobby. And now the power's out. Are you kidding me? This day couldn't get any worse. Melon, I have a bad feeling it's about to get a lot worse for you. Nah, bro. I'm chilling, dude. Oh, wait. There's snacks? Don't buy that. It's bad. It's how Santa kills you. I don't even want an energy drink right now. All I want to do is finish my shift and go to sleep. And then wake up Christmas morning with lots of presents under the tree. Exactly. Repairing Jenny. Run inside. Why would I want to run inside? I don't understand. Ah! Ah! You got captured by Santa Claus, you idiot! Dang it! Well done, Melon. Well done. Today, Sonny and I escaped from Barry's prison. But this time, he has his entire family. As we're escaping, we find the weirdest Barry family members. From this thick, double-cheeked up boy to Barry's extremely skinny uncle. What other weird family members does he have? Stick around to find out. Oh no, Melon. We're trapped in prison again. But this time, Barry recruited his wife and son. Oh no! Sonny, we've got to get out of here. It doesn't look like normal. There's no escape fence. You're right, bro. We're gonna have to destroy these golden bars and make a run for it. Ah! Wait, they don't see me. No, never mind. They're after me. Hold on. Let me break these bars. Oh, no. Wait, I made the getaway, bro. And what's this? I gotta get this milk. There's like milk on the floor. Maybe it'll unlock a secret room. Yo, you're right. One out of three, bro. Ow, I just got whacked by these guys. Yo, they're slow, Melon. How did you get caught by that family? Dude, is this one of Barry's siblings? Why is he lost? Up. Yeah, that's Uncle Skinny Larry. They didn't like him because he's not as thick. They needed him to fatten up a little bit. So they locked him in prison and they're forcing him to eat pizza with olive oil. Bro, this is so much different than normal berries. It's like a whole new game. Uh, yeah, and I didn't expect that vent to break. Now I'm running from Barry. Okay, I'm good. You are a fool, Sonny. But also, what's that hit marker down there? You want to go explore that? Dude, it's just a more fun lock. I already checked it out. Okay. I got to jump fast this time. Here we go. I finally caught up. Sonny, there is a very creepy lizard bear. Ow! He's like a gremlin. What is that? Oh, that was creepy. Enough of this silly business, Sonny. We need to bounce out of here. Yes, let's focus up. And 360 off the trampoline! Oh, no. Sonny, he's back! And he'll kill you if you fall in. Ew, it's the sewer fishman berry. That looks so weird. Whatever, bro. I'm gonna flick this handle and cross over. Wait, what happens if you actually fall in? Does he come and kill you? Oh, he's eating me! Nice one, bro. I don't think that was worth testing out. I needed to see. That was a really cool animation, actually. And crank that soldier, and let's get across. Yeah, but what if he turned you into a fish monster as well? Let's look, Sonny. I'm a melon. I'm fine. Yo, I want to get to the other side of this, and maybe we can make it over to police daycare. You just have to go this way, Sonny. For the police king. Yeah, why is this guy so weird? I never knew they had a secret lizard berry in the sewers. Yeah, lizard fish berry. Open this door. Yo, we're we're in daycare. Oh, look at it, little baby Barry. We're gonna do. What are you gonna do? Nothing, because you're a baby, and all you have is a giant diaper on. Now give me this milk. Police milk vest. Sonny, we just need one more of those, and then we can access whatever they give us. Yeah, but Melon, I need you to come back here and observe this for me. What do you need, bro? I found it. Proof that the world is flat. Take that, glow birthers. No, Melon, let's not tell our viewers the world is flat. That's a bad idea. But it says it right here. The Roblox world is flat. Full of Barry's prisons. So don't ever get trapped. Let's just open this up and leave now. And press that button and bounce, Sonny. Yeah, I bounced into my grave. It's okay, Sonny. Just try again. Try again, little buddy. Yeah, I'll be there in a second. Just jumping over the blocks. And I'm gonna time my jump a little bit better this time. There we go. Are we gonna race that little police car, you think? Oh, no, don't jump in there. Don't go in there, Melon. Sonny, I was gonna say, what police car are you talking about? This little one right here. You don't see it? Yeah, wait, maybe you can do some parkour. Yeah. Ah! I just realized, bro, in the background, those blocks spell D-E-A dead. Sonny, let's just dip out of here, bro. You're right. Opening this ventilation shaft and let's explore what's inside. Oh, wait, no. We gotta jump over him quick. We don't have to jump over him. <laughs> it just extended
landed a bridge for us. You're right, bro. And now we're not dead. Instead, we are dads. Like dads. Because we just told that baby he can't mess with us. Exactly. Now let's move, Sonny, because it's very creepy in here. Whoa. There's an extra thick berry, Sonny. That's what I was going to say, bro. Where did his neck go? Bro, what do you mean? He's got like four necks. Sorry, his chin. Where did his chin go? It is fused in with his neck, Sonny. It is the top roll. Uh, Melon? This is like the parkour ones where you have to go with your plank. Oh, no. Oh, no. I kind of want to know what happens when you drop down there, though. Yeah, but why don't you let one of those big berries try it out? You don't even need planks for this. What was the point of the planks? They actually made it way harder, because look at this. I can hang off the side with a plank. Check it out. Ready? Huh! Huh! See me? Yo, dude, you playing a risky game right now. Watch this. Huh! Uh, Melon? No! Yo, he's like Shrek. He picked me up like an ogre. You are a fool, Sonny. Actually, I'm just dead. But now I'm gonna go across and beat the game. I was trying to glitch out of the map, but I could not do it successfully. That's okay. Let's just focus up and escape this place before we get turned into little watermelon dust. Oh, no. I don't want to get grinded to a pulp. No! Oh, no, Melon. You led us both to our death. Idiot. Literally, that was you, bro. Skinny Larry over here is fine somehow, but you and I got smushed. Dude, how are you supposed to make that jump? Carefully, like I just did. Hey, bacon hair, what's good? Sonny, why is your torso pink again? I don't want to talk about it, bro. Sometimes that just happens. I put a new shirt on. What the heck? Are you serious? How? Actually, Melon, you shouldn't be the one asking why my shirt's pink. It should be me accusing you. Let me guess. You took my yellow shirt and you washed it with all your red ones and now it's pink. Sonny, you just have a girl's shirt on right now. It's okay. It's okay. Nah, bro, you did the long laundry again and you mess my clothes up. It's okay, you're in tune with your feminine side. There's nothing wrong with that. Whatever, bro. I'm just escaping this prison so I don't have to deal with you anymore. And Sonny, we gotta keep our eyes peeled for this last milk. Oh, true, bro. Let me check behind this tree before we miss it. Nope, no milk. And I have been consumed by the doge. Bro, how did this dog eat you? They are so slow. Run, run! Oh no, that dog could eat you. There's a three-headed berry dog. You're right, he's quick too. I gotta skedaddle. Or or you could just hide up in the tree. Oh yeah, that's a good idea, but I'm just gonna skedaddle, Sonny. I'm just looking for the milk. I don't want to miss it, you know? Be cool, Sonny. Be cool. All right, I'll try and stay cool and make this jump. Huh! Yes. And I'll flick this lever to open a castle door. Yo, it works. Bro, this is the coolest custom berries prison we've ever seen. It's so much better than the usual reskins. Exactly. Oof for life, Sonny. Oof for life. Yeah. And I'm gonna pull this ladder down before I get oofed. Yo. Uh, Melon? Did you see this? There's a gigantic berry peering through the wall looking at us. Bro, he's so creepy. I'm trying to wash my hands, but the sink doesn't work. That's it. Time to dynamite this. Yep, let me grab the dynamite right in here. And plant it. Hey, I busted it open. Yo, that was dangerous. We used the dynamite while it was still in our hand. I don't think that was a great plan. Nah, nah, Sonny. It was a perfect plan. Not as perfect as this parkour, bro. I'm escaping this classroom before you can train any more Barry. Oh, no, they got me. I think Barry is trying to make a Barry's army. So we'll have more Barry prisons and imprison the whole world. Yeah, that's not good. We got to get out of here and report him to the FBI, CIA, and whatever other organizations can help. And we got to dip effective immediately. Because who knows how far along into his plans he is. Oh, Melon, I think he's pretty far into his plans. Have you seen how many different berries he's got? That's a mutant berry, Sonny. With a berry riding the mutant berry, open the castle door and let's get out of here. Oh, no. The mutant and Barry got me. It's okay, Sonny. You will be forever consumed. I can't believe he actually ate me. This dragon just killed me. A dragon Barry just killed me. Yo, this is insane. What the heck? Sonny, you have to jump on the ducks to get across. Really? Yeah. I don't believe you. I trust me. It. Trust me, Sonny. Okay, I'm gonna trust you, and if I die, this is the last time I'm ever gonna believe a single word that comes out of your mouth. I cross my fingers. I cross my fingers. I'm fine. Bro, the dragon just vaporized me. See, I didn't lie to you. The ducks didn't kill you. It was the dragon. Ayo, still got that checkpoint. Dude, these trampoline jumps are tough. Yeah, I don't know what's up with them. It's like you have to hit it perfectly. I found it. The final milk. Prisoner berry unlocked. No way, bro. You're getting every Easter egg. Look 
Look at me! You're the skinny Barry Larry! Yo, I'm actually kind of quick like this. I think it gives me a speed boost. Dude, that looks so weird. You are going fast, but you're just moonwalking. Yo! No! This is a boss Barry! And now it's my turn to destroy him. Uh-oh! Policeman! Where's my weapon? Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here, Sonny. I'm blasting! I don't have anything to blast him with! Well, that sucks. I'm absolutely destroying him. Bro, his eyeballs look crazy! His face is all kinds of messed up! He drank too much coffee! Dude, I'm just stuck here. I don't have any weapon to fight him with. That sounds like you problem, not a me problem. I've almost got him destroyed, bro. This boss fight was easy. All I had to do was shoot him in the mouth with a lot of missiles. Yes! I finally have a rocket launcher. And he's destroyed. Now I just walk around the pit and I should be good. Wait, you don't even have to move. Yeah, he was kind of low-key easy to beat. Just give me a second, Sonny. Give me like two minutes and I'll be there. Alright, I'm gonna wait for you in my super duper car. This thing looks fast, bro. Four turbo jets. And they're dead. And I've waited long enough. I'm out of here! Wait, Sonny, I'm with you, though. Don't leave me! Yo, get your own car. How do I even get on a car? Dude, you stole my car. My car, what is it doing? Was it flying for a second? Hey, yo, I made it! I beat the game! Sonny, I'll, I'll be there in a second, and then we need to report this to the FBI. The Federal Barry Investigations. That's true. We can't have any more Barry prisoners like this mutating and becoming more powerful. But we can have our viewers get goaded by pressing that like and subscribe button. Do it right now. Today in Roblox, we're trapped on a scary playground trying to survive the night, but there's an evil clown on the loose who tries eating us. Please help us escape by pressing the like button in under two seconds. One, two, let's go. Melon, we're here on the playground experience, but I think our parents left us out way after dark. Yes, yeah, Sonny, where the heck are we right now? Turns out we just snuck out at night to play at the playground. Okay, Sonny, don't get in trouble. Okay, we gotta be very sneaky. Extra sneaky beaky. Ooh, what's this shiny purple thing? Bubble gum. Yo, you found one out of 12 bubble gums. I need more bubble gum, but we must go. Oh, I see another one over here. Yes, Melon, grab it. We need more bubble gum. But we also gotta get to the playground quickly. Bubble gum and another bubble gum. And we're at the playground. Bro, this place looks so fun at night. Bubble gum, bubble gum. There is a lot of trash on the ground, Sonny. I'm not gonna cap. Maybe we should clean it all up then. Yo, we're such good people, bro. We sneak out at night to clean up trash from the playground. We are solid citizens, bro. We're like trash vigilantes. Exactly, dude. Any parent should be proud. Children by day, trash collectors by night. That's our superhero motto. And bubblegum collectors by day and night. Always bubblegum. Bubblegum. So much bubblegum now that I'm looking around. And so much trash, bro. We still need to clean up all these bottles. I know. And it takes forever to pick up an aluminum can for some reason. It's heavy, bro. How do I get to that bubble gum? I think I got to bounce on a trampoline. Boing. Oh, I almost got it. And there we go. And boys, I found something that piqued my interest. <laughs> yes. Yes. Melon, what are you doing? Nothing, bro. Nothing. Where are you, Sonny? On the playground having fun. I'm collecting bubble gums. Bro, we need to put them in the bin, bro. Bring it to the bin already. Nah, I'm getting this bubble gum. And then I'm sliding. Oh, wait. I can't. I'm just trapped. I saw you drink it. What did you do? I became super fast, Sonny. Just like the Flash. And why is there this creepy clown head? Uh, where do you see that? Right in front of me? Uh, it's probably just a toy we should clean up, Sonny. Don't worry about it. Probably just a toy, yeah. Why don't you clean up the toys? I will. And not look at the clown. Ah! Sonny, why? That wasn't me, bro. I told you not to look at the clown. You scumbag, Sonny. Stop jump scaring me. It's scary. Just pick up the toys already, bro. Once the playground's cleaned, we can play Sandman. Bro, you know I'm gonna win. Nah, bro, you never win. Gotta go all the way over here. How do you get up there, bro? You climb the slide. Look. Yeah, there you go. And give me that. Yeah. And then Melon, look. This is the creepy clown head. Sonny, I'm in the slide. Where is it? Oh, it's right here. Here, I see. Ah! Why? You shouldn't look at it. You're so annoying, bro. Put the toys in the box. I'm putting the toys in the box. Why do I gotta press this six times? Because, Sonny, the game devs are annoying. And I got the last one. Ding! Now what? 
We need to access all the bubble gums. It's time to build a sand castle, Sunny. First, we should grab a shovel. There it is. Here we go. Give me that. How do I grab it? Oh, yeah, here we go. Pick up shovel. And time to build. Exactly, Sunny. Yeah, I'm gonna let you build while I go collect bubble gum. Build. Bro, if anything, I should be collecting bubble gum. I'm so fast. I know, I know, but you're fast on the objectives, too. Look at you go. Come on, Sunny. Come on. What, you, you you should probably be doing this because I can't even jump on these rooftops. Oh, I gotta use this and this. Bro, just build the sandcastle. I'll look for the bubble gum. Bubble gum! Wait, we only need three more? And then we've collected all 12. And that's another bubble gum. Yeah, there's only one that I can't find because I got the 11th bubble gum right here. I'm building a pretty crazy sandcastle. I'm not gonna lie. All right, well, I got 11 bubble gums. Let me come check on the sandcastle. Here, I'll let you finish it, Sonny. I'll let you do a little sandcastling. I'm I'm gonna look for another bubble gum. Yo, Melon, I'm just gonna put the flag in. Here we go. There you go, Sonny. Boom! Sandcastle complete. There's a lot of abandoned buildings around this park. I'm not a big fan of it. Now let's build more towers around the playground. Bro, I'm building sandcastle towers everywhere. Let's go. Sonny, I can't find this last bubble gum. It's okay. I'm the bubble gum hunter. I can do it if you need me. Up here. Ran around this corner. Build it. Oh, I found a ladder up. Did you climb this abandoned building? Oh, Sonny, I found a secret key. What does it unlock? That could be pretty useful. Bro, we've got to find a locked area to see what it opens. Do you think it's going to get us inside of a haunted house? Maybe it'll open a secret toy chest? What are you feeling? Sonny, I think I know where this goes. I think it enters right in this maintenance building because there's like a keyhole here. Come on, let me in. Dang it, it won't let me in. I keep hearing like screams in the background like, hey. Yeah, it's pretty creepy. Or is it somebody snoring super loud? Just the ambiance, Sonny. Don't worry about it. Did you open that house up yet? Did you find the last bubble gum? No, I'm trying to figure out where to use this key. I can't enter this house. And one more sand tower. It's all yours. <laughs> I knew you'd sneak in. I've got it. Wait, what the heck? Melon? I can't build it, Sonny. I think I have to have my shovel out. Here we go. It's almost as if the playground was our own little fortress, Melon. We've constructed it, and we will protect it. But now let's play a little bit. Woo! Play and get a hundred orbs. Dude, look at this place. It's lit up. Yes, collect them all, Sonny. It's Liddy. Liddy. I was made for this. I was made for this, Sonny. No, those are mine. Ugh. Mm, it's okay. You get all the ones on the playground. I'll get the ones on the outskirts. And just don't run into the bad guy, okay? Ah! Sunny stop! What? The bad guy can show up sometimes. So annoying, Shiny. I don't like it. Let me collect these orbs. Oh, you're getting those ones? Those ones are annoying. Thought you were gonna get the ones where you could zoom. I am, Shiny. Zoom! Did you climb this? That's cool. Yeah, bro. It's a rock climbing wall. Jump it! Oh, I missed. We just need... Oh, we got them all. Let's go! That was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed my playtime. Same here, same here. But where's that last bubble gum? I don't know, Sonny. Can't find it anywhere. Yeah, what is that, Sonny? It looks like some kind of scary balloon. No, Melon, stay away from the red balloons. Everyone knows that's where the evil clown lives. It's actually a Halloween balloon. We've got to follow this balloon, but you're way ahead of it already. Yeah, Sonny, I kind of skipped ahead a little bit. But where, oh, where is it going? I think it's taking us to the last bubble gum. Yo, you're right, Sonny. Let's go. No! Yeah, we did it. And then it's leading us into this creepy dark forest. Yeah, we should totally follow this to our death. There's definitely no bad guys or monsters or scary clowns or villains or anything that could possibly go wrong in here. Yeah, I don't think so either, Sonny. There might even be a giant blender where it only eats watermelons. Ah! Ah! Hello? Uh, Sonny, I don't like that. Why is there a clown? Hello, Mr. Clown! Run! Bro, bro, you are so fast. You are so much faster than me. Run, Sonny! I'm running as fast as I can. He's right behind me. Keep going, Sonny. Just zoom. Harness your inner Bloxy Cola. Ah! Bro, that was cursed. Woo! We made it back to the playground. We're alive. We did it. We're the goats. We are the goats. Um, but what do we do now? Why don't we just head home, Sonny? There's a, there's a clown that's very scary, and I don't think this playground's that safe. Yeah, but it's also our 
playground. We cleaned up the litter. We put away the toys. We made sandcastles. We gotta protect this place. Well, Shoney, we have two choices. We could either run or we could hide. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hide. Yeah, bro, I'm gonna go hide. I found a secret key, so maybe I can enter somewhere. I'm gonna protect this place. <gasps> Sonny, come with me. I found a secret. Requires key. I've opened it. Nah, that's for babies. You have fun with that. I'm gonna protect our sandcastle. What did I just find, bro? There's a power box here, and there's a basement. What's in this basement? What have I found, bro? It's like a whole secret base down here. That's awesome, bro, but I'm gonna hide right next to our sandcastle to keep it safe. All right, good for you, Sonny. There's some weird stuff going on. What is this door? What is this door? Open it. I need to see what's over here. Uh, oh, hey, Sonny. Wait, what? What do you mean, hey, Sonny? I don't see you. What? I'm in a can. I don't see. What? You didn't run away or hide. I got caught by the clown? What do you mean? I'm hiding in a barrel. What? I found a secret. You are dead. Well, guys, I showed you the secret dead ending. You die, but it's secret. And I'm showing you how to hide and save your sand castle. Wait, now I have to run? How do I run? I'm, I I'm stuck in here. I got caught by Teddy and I'm dead. Uh, it says, try and find out what lies in the basement. Melon, you figured that out already. It's death. Yeah, I, I really didn't understand what happened. But it was ultra top secret. Goats, that was awesome. So make sure you like and subscribe. We got hired by this train and forced to work the late night shift. But we got trapped. And we find out there's a killer on board. Can we collect the clues and stop this killer in time? Or will they crash the train before we can save everyone? Watch until the end to get goaded. Melon, we made it on the train. We got brand new jobs. Welcome aboard to the bullet train. Please take a seat. So anyway, what did that say? It said it's night one, the lights are out. I think the boss is going to contact us in a second. All aboard the VIP Express. We should be getting to our stop shortly. Hey, the VIP Express. Finally, someone's showing respect. This guy looks very VIP, Sonny. Tonight, I need you to take charge of the dining. Yeah, oh, don't worry, monsieur. We'll be handling your dining this evening. Look at that moustache. It's so delicate. Yo, wait. Is Sketch and Flamingo on this train? Bro, where's the Sunny and Melon characters? Bro, I don't know. But right now, I'm taking the order of two very posh looking people. Oh, he wants a mega burger. What is a mega burger? It's a burger that's mega. It's coming right up, sir. No problem. All right, Melon, I'll head into the kitchen and start cooking up these patties. Yeah, dude, Sketch and Flamingo are here. That's goofy. Yeah, bro. Check this out. I'm cooking a patty in a frying pan. I'm making a nice smash burger. Bro, how long is this gonna take? Okay, I got the patty. And then I gotta place it on a bun somewhere. Oh, look at these buns, bro. They look cold. They need to be toasted up. Grab them buns and start cooking, hun. I got the lettuce and the cheese. I'll apply the toppings on top. And it's ready to serve one mega burger. Let's go. Deliver that mega burger. Our customer is gonna be so happy. And one mega burger coming right up. Wait, are you guys gonna share this? I mean, I guess it is a mega burger. It's probably enough for two people. Oh, never mind. It's all for him. Oh, it's for the monsieur with the posh jacket. You are so welcome, my good son. I think he's actually the sheriff, bro. Look at his helmet. Oh, you right. He actually might be. Wait, what? He just disappeared. So did everyone else. Wait. Oh, wait, no. It was just these two. Uh, no, Sonny. Everyone's gone. Where did everybody go? Uh, we're probably just losing sight of things. And it's because we can't see because the electricity went out. Yeah, it's definitely not blood on the ground. Everything's normal. Then why does it say three days here, Sonny? What is going on? What is happening? What is up with all of our jobs, bro? Every time we get employed to work a night shift somewhere, stuff goes really creepy. Really creepy, guys. <laughs> really scary. Ah! Got him! Take that, bro! What is wrong with you, bro? Let's reset this electrical box and save the passengers. Yep, I'm on it, bro. The lights are back on. We should be able to find everyone. No, no not everything is okay. The power went out. Our passengers vanished. Uh, Sunny, the passengers are back. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, I think everything's fine, bro. There was nothing on the floor. It didn't say three days. There was no blood. All's good. I told you we were seeing things in the dark. Sure it, ain't nothing. it ain't nothing. Boss is always the worst, dude. Yeah, I don't really think he's good at his job. I have a feeling he's the evil villain. Bro, this guy is so posh, he's got diamond glasses on. Yeah, I don't think he can see. All he sees is that money. Mega turkey? What is a mega turkey? We're about to find out. It's in the fridge. Would you like to retrieve it from the fridge? All right, no problem. I have collected a mega turkey. <laughs> now you gotta cook it up. I have now cooked a mega turkey. Ew, you're gonna cook it in the microwave? That's gross. 
Gross. Cooking mega turkey. It actually looks pretty good, even though we microwaved it. It's okay, Sandy. They don't know that. We'll tell them we put it in the oven. Yo, look at this guy. He's eating mega turkey right now. This guy is disgusting, bro. He's like that little toe guy from the game. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, the da the Duma Dama game or something, or that other creepy one. Yeah, bro. Give this guy his mega turkey. Yeah, I actually don't think it's the Daruma game guy, but he's still really creepy, this dude. It's the other weird game. Anyways, one turkey coming right up. Your five-star microwaved meal. Looks great. Yeah, don't question it. Don't question. Oh, no, Sonny. Not again. Why did he just disappear? I don't understand. <laughs> Let's not worry about it. Let's just clean up the dishes and everything will be fine. Everything will be totally fine. Those dishes were indeed nasty, Sonny. It's because they had microwavable turkey on them. Wait, what? Who is this guy on the front of the train? Uh, I don't know, Sonny. Who is it? That is so cursed, bro. I think that's the murderer. Wait, there's a killer on the loose? I don't know, or the monster. I, I just thought this was the conductor taking our first stop. Uh, Sonny, we're not stopping, bro. The brakes have failed. That's fine. Full steam ahead to the next location. Bro, need to call the boss. What do you mean? What do you mean, full steam ahead? All right, let's call boss. Where is he located, though? Phone back here somewhere. Hey, hey boss. The brakes. I wish you the best of luck. That's it? Bro, this boss is the worst. He doesn't even care if we die. At no least he... Well, at least he tried. Wait, what? Now we're suddenly gonna die. It went from no problem to we're gonna die. Just tell the people it's just a delay. <laughs> what? Wow. You might die. Don't worry about it. Just tell them it's a delay. It's a murder on the railway, but just tell all the passengers it's fine and only a minor delay. All right, so it's time to inform the passengers. Let me handle this, Melon. <clears throat> Excuse me, sir. Uh, you have a minor inconvenience. Nothing to be concerned about. Bro, this is so many passengers to inform. Form. Oh, yes, you're going to die. Don't worry about it. Yes, merely an inconvenience. Death, that's all it is, is speed running life. Don't worry. You will die one day anyway, so don't panic. Yep. <laughs> we're just speeding up the process for you. You're welcome. Yep, we're giving you a speed running world record. Here you go. Oh, sorry, Alberto. Flamingo, you're dead. Sketch, you're dead. Yep, you guys are all going to die. Just so you know, enjoy that final meal. <laughs> and you might get murdered before the train crashes. At least the boss said we did a good job. Are <laughs> They're all fooled. Merely an inconvenience. We won't get sued. <laughs> what? Yo, let's go. Bro, their families will still know that they died. Nah, nah. All right, Melon, you're on front desk duties. I'm going to chill at the bar. You got this. All right, front desk. That's somewhere over here, I believe. Yeah, somewhere over there. It's the opposite way. Tell me when you found it. I'm just having a drink. I'm in some Bloxy Cola. Have found the front desk. Ah! Why? Did it get you? You didn't even get scared. Oh, so annoying, Sonny. This guy wants to enter room one. Here you go, bud. Ooh, there's keys. Enjoy that room one. Of course, Monsieur Fancy Mustache wants a room. I knew you were rich. <laughs> He's got the private suite. Here you go, sir. I love how they just vanish into thin air. Uh, Sonny, did you hear that? What was that sound? I didn't I didn't hear anything suspicious. What did you hear? It was like, yeah. Ah! Ah! Sonny, I told you. I told you it was a murderer. Who are you? And what do you want? What? Uh, what? Why? Oh, Melon, this is bad. This is very bad. You scumbag. Why? Why? What is your end game? Why? Oh, he's gone. And why are you telling us all of this? Well, I hope whoever's in room one or room two is all right. Yep. And we really do need the SWAT or some police or military help. We need something. Call them quick, Melon. I'm calling them. No one is helping you. <gasps> It's the monster. I told you to sit back. Have fun. Have fun? How can I have fun? No. Why would you do this? I don't understand. Oh, no, Melon. Didn't it say on the ground three days? And now we're on night three, the race against time. Uh... Sonny, I've got a bad feeling about tonight. Me too, bro. I have a feeling the train's gonna crash. And I think the killer's on board too. Maybe he's one of these other players. I bet it's Flamingo! It might be. It might be. Nah, he's too dumb. Never mind. Question is who? 
Who could it be? We've got to locate some evidence. Search for evidence, Sonny. There's a question mark up there. I'm on it. Let's see what it says. Ooh, a little note that they left behind. What does this mean? Oh, I can travel the world while staying in one spot. I'm long and I'm fat and I never will stop. My passengers puke when I'm out of control. But when I stay on my track, I'm good for the soul. What does that mean, Sonny? I don't know, but one of these passengers must know. Hello, Mr. Mustache. You look like the kind of person who would know a lot about this. I can travel the world while staying in one spot. I am long and I'm fat and I'll never stop. Is it a train? That's what I figured. I mean, but how does that help us? We know we're on a train that's about to crash. When I stay on my tracks, I'm good for the soul. But none of these people know what it is. This last one surely will. Maybe it's the conductor? <gasps> the worker. The bartender. What is it? I used to work as a police officer. Yo, tell us the clue. Tell us what it means. We locked up a criminal mastermind who used riddles like that. Oh no, bro. This is like the Joker. Okay. Well, what's the answer? <gasps> What? That's so mean. Oh no, Sonny. Oh no! Sonny, that means we've gotta stop this train! We can't let it happen! Also, I have no clue how this note would ever tell you anything about an orphanage. Um, but you know, I'm out of control. You know it does, obviously, Sonny. You just gotta look deeper into it. Whatever, bro. Let's just catch this guy before this train crashes and not overthink it. I'm confronting everybody. Yeah, the killer! Why would you murder? They said they've never heard or seen of this person in their life, Mel, and I believe them. Yeah, I kinda believe him, dude. That's something the killer totally wouldn't say. This player looks very suspicious here. Nah, dude, this guy looks suspicious. He's wearing the same outfit as the masked murderer. Oh, you're right. <laughs> and he's got a creepy smile. Yeah, I don't believe that. That is cap. Oh, wait, what? Oh, no. What just happened? What just happened? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Somebody screamed at this guy. We were looking right at him, so it can't be him. Bro, someone is a Caposaurus Rex right now. But who? Who died? Who is this? No! I got you right ah, what the heck? What? Dude, chill. Okay, Melon, I'm dipping. I'm out. Oh, no. Sonny, we gotta dip. Run to the engine room. Come on, let us move. I don't want to die. Run, run, run. I'm going. This is so creepy, Sonny. Wait, he hasn't even started chasing us. We're chilling. Oh, this is making my head hurt a bit. Yeah, what is going on? Ew, there's rats. Well, Sonny, we made it to the engine room. Now what? I don't know. And how did rats get on the train? I don't understand, bro. Where did they come from? <laughs> We're murdering rats. No, I'm sorry. Kill the ratas. Should have got two more. Hold on. They're all dead now. Nicely done. We need serious help, Sonny. And I agree. Me too. The final showdown. <laughs> Why'd you get a banana peel, Sonny? It was to protect us from the killer. So annoying. We have to investigate this corpse again. It's probably not even there anymore. Bro, wait, I just realized these, this is Creekcraft too. I feel like all these guys are YouTubers. Yo, you right, bruh. But where's Sunny and Melon? I don't know. I don't understand. One day we'll be at the forefront of these types of games, brother. We'll be there on this train eating giant mega turkey. I hope so, Sonny. I hope so. Whoa. Did you try and stab me? No, I would never do such a thing. Maybe there's evidence in a suitcase. Who's got a suitcase? Oh, there's luggage up here. Here. Oh, there's luggage down here. We must find the matching knife, Melon. This must have come from a set. You're right. You're actually very smart, Sonny. Wait, the Riddler's mask? He's a passenger here, Sonny. So we've been walking past him the whole time. My money's still on this guy. Yeah, that is the same exact outfit. Wait, what? Oh, no. Uh, what the little heck is going on right now? I don't want to know. Four days ago. What? Why didn't the cops tell anyone? This man is powerful. He is known for his tricks. Yeah, he's the smartest criminal of all time, according to the news report. This is not good. Phone calls, make people vanish, and cut power with his mind. Wait, with his mind? He's literally a wizard. He's pure evil. If oh, no. Him, report him at the oh, no. Bank. I didn't know he had superpowers, too. I was gonna say, no wonder he broke out of prison, dude. He broke in. He went to prison because he felt like it. We're doomed, Sonny. The cops, they don't even know he's on board. It's okay. There's a chance we could still figure out how to stop him. Whoa, we're gonna kill this guy? We have to, Sonny. It's the only way. We can literally chuck this knife. Yeah, that's pretty cool. We need to investigate these bedrooms, though. The killer's probably located 
inside of one. Dude, maybe I gave him a key. That would actually make sense. Evidence! The shirt, Sonny. The shirt, the knife. Whoever was sleeping in room two. It was the guy with the fancy mustache! And check it out, I have his mask! How could it be Monsieur Fancy Mustache that could do such a thing? He's pure evil. Okay, we've got to warn them all, starting with this guy. You start warning them, Sonny. Why am I telling the same guy that is the killer to hide? No, no, we'll tell him last. We'll tell him last. Oh, hide? Oh my god. Hide? Oh my god. Melon, I need your help before I confront him. Are you ready? Yes. Die! Wait, what? He vanished! Dang it. Dang it, Sonny. Don't worry. We'll get him. We've got to block the doorway for the passengers, but which way did they hide? They're all hidden in the kitchen, Melon. We must protect them. Yes. Now lock the door. He's probably in there. I mean, he's definitely in there. We know we put him in there, but all right. We locked the door and it teleported us. Damn. Is everyone okay? Oh, boy. It's time, Sonny. We take him down. You're right. One minute till the train crashes. We got to stop him fast. I don't want to look back. Look behind me. Help me. You put me in this suit. Wait, what? Oh uh, no, Sonny. We've got to guess which one is the real Riddler. Real killer. He's using me to trick you. What if they're both the real one? Oh no, Sonny. Which one is it? This was me on board. I'm a normal guy. Yo. Okay. This is him on board. He's the real Riddler. It is him. It's the guy with the mustache. It's the guy with the mustache. Yeah, but how are we going to know the difference? Because, Sonny, we have to know because I gave the guy with the mustache the room two key. I know, but we can't see his mustache. He has a mask on. Sonny, you are missing the point. Just vote for the first guy. Oh, it's that easy. Kill both Riddlers. No, kill Riddler one. Kill Riddler one. Fine. Plus, he's got the scary voice, so it's kind of obvious. Oh, wait, we got to kill him, Sonny. Is, uh, which one is the real? Is this Riddler one? I don't know. He's getting stuck around the door. Ow, he killed me. Don't go in there. Bro, how am I supposed to kill him? I don't know. Just, just survive. Just run away. Oh, I got him. He was pretty easy to kill. Nice. Nice. Uh, now, what do I do? Hero ending. We killed the right Riddler and we're able to call the police for help. Let's go. We saved the train. Let's go because I am an awesome detective and remembered that it was the mustache man. Even though he was your favorite passenger, he turned out to be a super villain. Yeah, you're right. And you guys can be superheroes by pressing that like button to support our channel and checking to make sure you're subscribed so you never miss a video. In this video, Sonny and I have to escape from Sir Mr. Scary's Magic. This guy is honestly so creepy. He even has sporks for hands. Also, I challenge every viewer right now to grab their nearest spork and click subscribe with it. I bet she can't. Yo, Melon, we're stuck here in this creepy dude, Sir Scary's mansion. Oh, gosh. Bro, look at it, dude, man. It looks so messed up. Bro, he needs to see a dentist. He's got Tic Tacs for his top teeth and then these shark spikes at the bottom. Whatever, bro. I just want to get out of this place. Pull the lever. Yo, what? Yo. Melon, look at him. He's right here. He's sleeping. Interrupt him. Let's go. He's chasing us. He woke up. Just follow the footprints. We got to get out of here. Move it. Move it. Move it, bruh. Sonny, he's actually pretty quick. I think he might be gaining on us. No. Look at his big top hat, bro. He's so weird. Wait, Wait. why is this person running backwards? He's actually- Wait, no, no, no. We're, li we're making distance. We're going to make it, Sonny. Bro, the defaults. They got killed. Look, he's back asleep. This dude sleeps. Again on the job, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna jump down and be like, yo, what's up? You doofus. Look at those teeth. You can't even grab me, bro. I'm jumping through your face. All right, let's just keep moving though, Melon. We don't want to risk him waking up again. There's no scapping me. Yo, what's a scapping? Oh, uh, escape. Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, of course, yeah, my bad. <laughs> Melon, don't look down, but you're gonna get juiced into a smoothie if you fall in. Nah, uh, bro, my rind's so thick, I would clog that machine. <laughs> Bro, I could imagine that. Just like you do the toilet all the time. Ow! Easy game for a professional like me. And then I dance on that fool. Ah, uh, bro. You think you go with the sauce? That was easy, dude. I just made a little bit of a mistake. Yeah, just a little bit. Now check out this next stage. Look at these axes. You ain't gonna do nothing. Melon, what happened, bro? I don't want to talk about it. Oh, no. That looks spooky, bro. I might have done a little something something, okay? Don't be mad. What did you do? I'm going to help you. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, no. That's karma, bro. You want to see what karma looks like? No. Stay away. Stay away. 
Yes. No. There you go, bucko. That's what karma looks like. Then he makes the run. He makes the run again. Easy game. And this is karma. No. Why? Why do you have a tank? I'm beautiful. So annoying, son. Yo, just get through these axes, dude. Why are you so slow? You're so toxic, bruh. Why are you so slow? Like, bruh, bruh. Come on. Yeah, I might be the goat, guys. Comment down below what your favorite item is. Jump coil. Oh, wait, let me try this one. Shrink. Whoa, you have a tank, too. Get over here. Why am I shooting? What the heck? Or do you like the jetpack? The portable prison is my favorite. The tank's pretty goaded, too, though. Why am I shooting backwards? <laughs> Yo, look at me. I got a pogo, bro. You trash. This is so trash, bro. Here, let me help. Yo, I shot backwards, too. And blast. Okay, that's it. I'm out of here. Honey, come back here, buddy. No, thanks, Melon. I'm making the greatest escape. You can't hit me with those missiles, you nerd. Why? Pull the lever. Get up the ladder. Climb, climb, climb. Take the parkour. Okay, I can't. I cannot do this parkour. In a tank. Way too slow. Who would have thought a tank can't jump over parkour? Now flip this lever. And shrink that boy. Can you climb it? Oh my god, it's so glitchy. Hold on. Can you climb it? No. Sunny, stop. Stop it, Sunny. Just get up here, you small boy. Let's go. Stop with the tank, bro. I literally can't even hit you. I've been obliterated. Make the run quickly before he does. No, I can do this. Wait, no. Melon. Uh -huh. How do you like it, Sunny? How do you like it? Free fire. I, no. <laughs> what? On the respawn? Take this time again. Bro, oh, I'm alive. I'm goaded. Revenge! mean revenge. You ain't gonna hit me, bro. Why isn't this working? Why isn't this working? Whatever. Pogo, ow! Nice one, bro. That was a bad idea. That was a really, really bad idea. I'm just gonna go on to the next stage. Yeah, me too, me too, me too. I'm just gonna go through the fan blades. No! Get back here! Shoot it backwards. Did I get checkpoint? Please. No, I didn't get the checkpoint, <laughs> Melon. No! Now I'm gonna do this epic slide without you, Sonny. You are not gonna get the last- Hey, yo, what? I wasn't even in the blade. Let's go! Yo, this slide's crazy! You're not gonna get the the last laugh, Melon. I'll get my revenge. Why? Why are you so trash, Sonny? I don't understand. It must be lag. It would never be me. Purchase any item to disable ads. Yeah, get those ads off my face, bro. And then gotta time it. Thank you. Okay, I'm coming down. And hit the jump. Oh, he jukes him. He jukes him so good. What are you gonna do? I got a pogo stick. Surprise tank. No. Come on, just hit him. I'm too goaded. Too goaded. And get over the trap. Hey, what? Nice, Sonny. Nice job. All right, bro. We'll see. Oh, I gotta go do this ramp again. Are you joking? Oh, I'm she. Oh my god, this person's so huge. I forgot you shrunk me. Speed coil. That's what I needed. Oh, I fell off by accident. Mr. Melon, how about a truce? I'll think about it. Shoot them. Yeah, now you're gonna suffer. No. Now you're gonna. I can't see myself, but I'm gonna safely assume that you're. Oh well, you're going down with me. What? No. Why am I still in a cat? Oh, I'm dead. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Then he makes the jump by using a jetpack because he's goaded. No, I tried to snipe you. I missed. Yeah. What are you gonna do, bro? Open that one. I don't think you know what that looks like. No. Kill. Get him. Hey yo, which tank is more tankable? Kill out, Sunny. Crash. No. You can't hit anything. I fell. I am bad. I admit it. That was pretty sad. You didn't even get the checkpoint, bro. It's fine. I don't need it. I got this go to jetpack. You can't hit me. Oh, it's so hard to hit you in a jetpack. I know. <laughs> hey, Melon. I'm on your tail. Ow. Nice. Nice one, buddy. I'm about to go super sonic speeds. Yo, I'm doing front flips. Yo, skip. Melon, skip Come again. On. Let's do this. No, I died. Oh, I'm going goat mode. This is epic. Yeah, boy. I love when they add the front flip. Oh, no. Yeah, I did the same thing. Yep, I messed up. That's okay. Coming back to life now. Yeah, I made that jump like it's absolutely nothing. Dude, this is totally gnarly, bro. Like, shred the gnar. Freaking shredding, bro. Yo, do a flip with a 360. Did you do a 360 with a flip? Probably not, because you trash. Two 360s! Oh, no! Uh, I tried to style on it too much. Yo, Mr. Scary's got some creepy trees, though. Oh, whoa. Look at his blue face. He's huge. Ellen, did you jump through this portal into his mouth? Uh, yeah, I did. No, why did you shoot backwards? That's right. You tried to surprise me. I got the real surprise. That little tank in here. No, chill. Come down with me. No, why? That's right. We go down together like Romeo and Juliet. Hey, yo, chill. 
<laughs> no, it's just Romeo. Because Juliet's escaping. Yeah, you would be the girl. Yeah, because girls are awesome and powerful. You're right. And I keep slipping and falling like a doofus. Make the jump and not mess this up. No, Melon, stop it. Think about it. Think about the people. Oh, yeah. He's quick with it. He's quick with it. I'm over it. Oh, yes, got him. Okay, use these crates to build up. Okay, so I need a crate and I make a staircase for my shelf. Let's have a true smell and no more trolling. Okay, yeah, I agree. Build up here. Hey, what? I only need two crates, bro. I'm goaded. Dude, we're inside of his creepy body. Like, look at all of his walls. It's like we're in his veins, bro, and it's been cursed. Dude, this guy is actually evil. Yo, Melon, I'm gonna do the zip line with you. Chill, ch I'm still in a cave. Yes, I escaped. And zip line to safety. I just wanted to go on the zip line with. Yo, no, 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 no. Let's go. Whose tank is more tanky? No! My tank was goaded. I didn't get the checkpoint. No! No, not like this. This is totally not goaded. All right, this is not goaded, but I'm gonna still do it anyway because I'm actually in it, Tom. Yeah, I'm in it, Crikey, man. What does this say? Use the bounce pads below to get a Cross. Okay. Boing. Bounce again. And then I hit that next bounce. Oh, this needs to go all the way up. Okay. Speed Big bounce. Run. Oh, yo, buddy. Then I hit it with a pogo stick. Like, yo, chee. Yo, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right. Get off the pogo stick then. Melon! You got me killed. Wait, actually, let's go. I'm so goaded. Oh, I just ran off. I don't know what happened there. Speed coil. Now I'm talking. Oh, this is epic. This is epic. Speed coil. See you, Melon. Yo, wait up. Gotta go quick. Oh, no. I'm alive. How? I don't know what... What is going on? How are you? What is go? What are you doing? Okay, never mind. <laughs> I don't know how I survived in the first place. Yo, I don't even know what part of his body we're in anymore, but this is weird. It's cursed. It's so cursed. Maybe this is his booty hole. Yo, chill. That's that's cringe, bro. How is that cringe? If this is what his bum looks like, he is gonna need to see a doctor. Nah, uh, I don't know if it's like an interdimensional butt. Bro, what? Interstellar bum? All right, well, I don't want to be a part of Sir Scary's butt. This is this is just time for us to leave. Yo, stop, stop, stop. Melon, you're gonna make me mess up. Good. That's like what I'm trying to do right now. Hey, no. Let's go jump into this red portal. Did I escape through the booty? I escaped through the... Oh, we have to... Dude, we have to fight him. I'm coming through the portal. Let's go. Exiting. Yo, boss destroyer R4000. No, Melon. This is really bad. He's got sporks for hands. He's just a head, actually, for me. I'm shooting coils at him. Is his body with his head or is it just his head for you? It's just his big head, but look at his hands. They're sporks. The most powerful utensil of them all. It's so powerful. It's a spoon and a fork. Yo, I can actually spam this thing really quick. Goat mode, goat mode. Hey, yo! Oh, does he come back to full health? Why is he spinning? What is he doing? He shot a laser beam in my face. Where are you, Sonny? It sent me backwards. I gotta come through the portal again. Yo. Yo! Chill with that laser! He almost killed me with it. Yes, he's still low on health. One more shot in the mouth and I killed him. Let's go. Come on, I'm shooting him in the eyes. And he is finished. Let's go. Victory lap. Enter the portal. You can't shoot me. I'm too goaded. Get in my prison. Oh no. Wow, we died. I think we entered the final stage. Wait, what? How did we die, bruh? I put you in my prison and then you dragged me into the black hole of death. Now I go through. Yo, what is this? Escape through the forest? There's more. Bro, this is the way out. Gotta hurry up. I'm so slow. You're too quick, Sonny. Wait for me. Hold on. Use a helicopter to cross. <laughs> Nice, you just jumped into that hole. No, I'm good. Look at me. I'm way up here, bro. You're slow, dog. Here, let me help. Perfect shot. Aw, how are these missing? Those should have been goaded. Those should have been the best. You're so trash, sonny. You ain't catching me. I know what you're trying to do. I ain't trying to do nothing. I'm just trying to finish this level. Me too. What does this thing say here? Jump. You got it, bro. What? Does this kill me? Hello? I'm, I'm in a green goo. I'm gonna jump too. Oh, hold on. I'm so slow. Wait, Melon. I can see me. I see myself. I'm dancing at the end and I'm huge. Oh my lord, you almost hit me. Melon, chill, bro. Tanks should be sinking, not floating. You never know. Maybe it's a very floatable, buoyant tank. Let's go. Victory. We beat Sir Scary's mansion. And now I am Sir Scary. Get over here. Bro, you're creepy. <sighs> Yes! Get sniped. Get sniped. That's what you think, bro. That's what you think. Get sniped! No! At least I got the checkpoint. 
<laughs> did you though? Yes, I did though. Oh, you did. You lucky. I'm too quick for you, bro. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Otherwise, Melon's gonna be stuck inside of this prison forever. No, I'll free myself. I'll take us both down. Don't do it. Don't do it. Today, Melon and I are working the night shift at this scary zoo. Everything seems normal until the animals go missing and a monster sneaks into the zoo. Can we survive five nights and escape this place? Or will something terrifying happen? Stick around until the end of the video to find out. Welcome to your first night of the wild zoo. Zoo. I need you to ensure the animals are safe at night. Whoa, Melon, we're in charge of the zoo. We're working the night shift. It's a goat. You have four nights to prove your worth, or you're fired. I don't want to get fired. Today, I need you to feed the animals. Be careful of the tiger. These animals are so goofy looking. Yeah, that tiger's huge. You can walk inside using these doors. Good luck. Let's do this. Okay, bro. Our first objective is to grab animal food from the gift shop and try and feed the tiger, I think. All right. But how do we even get inside? Oh, I don't know, bro. We got to find the gift shop. It's right here, Sonny. Obviously. Okay. Workers only. That's us. Feed the animals now. Grabbing some animal food. Don't let them eat you. The animals can eat me? Of course I don't want to let them eat me. Look, Sonny, it's a goat. Wait, that's a goat? I swear that was a rock. Bro, I think that's a goat at least. I don't really know what it is. Nah, bro. That's not a goat. That's like a desert cat. That's a floppa, bro. It literally says it right here. It's a floppa. Oh my goodness. I didn't even realize. All right. We've got to feed these animals though. I'm going to head to the exclamation points marked this way and I'm going to feed this bear. I'm going to feed this deer. It should be easy enough. I don't think a deer will eat me, right? Place food. Why is the food bloody? It's meat, bro, or berries. I fed these deer's meat. I don't think deers eat meat. Well, I got to feed these snakes, bro. Bro, I'm scared. Why is it gotta be snakes? Uh, don't eat me. Got it. Yo, that is a big slab of steak. Uh, Sonny, I have to feed a bear. And he's looking very menacing in the corner. Dude, I'm the one feeding the bear right now. I gotta be very... Ah, bear! Don't get killed, Melon. Run for it. All right, all right. Here's my chance. Place the food and get out of here. Okay, I gotta move. I'm still stuck in the exhibit with the bear. Don't think so fast. Give them their favorite toys too. All right, should be easy enough. All you have to do is use the special teleport. Order. All right, we need to get those toys and teleport. Let's do this. There's a teleporter in this zoo? Yeah. Also, I wonder what happens if I touch the snake. Yo, I can move him around. Yeah, take that, snake. All right, I'm out. I don't want to die. Yeah, Melon, all zoos come equipped with teleporters. You didn't know that? I did not, Sonny. Not one bit. Well, now you do. You learn something new every day. Wait, so then why don't we just use the teleporters in the zoos to, like, teleport to space and stuff? Because that goes against the teleportation objective of giving toys to zoo animals, bro. Ah! Why would you do that? <laughs> I got him. Yes. Yep. Everyone knows teleporters are just to give away rubber ducks. Freaking terrifying, Sonny. Why would you do that? I needed to scare you, bro. I wanted to make sure you were paying attention. All right. We're sending the teleporting toys through. Hey, rubber duck for the deer. Teddy bear for the bear. That makes sense. Is that the floppa? No, nah, that was the floppa. I'm proud. The animals love you. Thanks, boss. I'll check in with you later. You got this. I love the animals too. Okay. What else are we supposed to do, though? What was that? Um, Sonny, what just happened? It sounded like a huge crash. I have a feeling one of the animals escaped. Everything looks fine over here. What's that sound? Um, it's nothing, Sonny. Let's just investigate this ticket booth. Yep, I'm on it. Yeah, how did this happen? Oh, heck no. What did you do? We didn't do anything, boss. It was probably the weather. Things don't move themselves. Fix it now. Yeah, I said it was a giant gust of wind. Sonny, I think one of the animals escaped. Uh, as long as it's not the tiger, we should be okay. Let's just fix this really quick. Bro, we're strong. Nicely done. You been hitting the gym, bro? Yeah, bro. Getting those muscles? I'm getting jacked out here. Getting strong enough to kill a bear. No, Melon, we're here to protect the animals, not kill them. Oh, okay. Turn off power to the zoo. Okay. Why do we want to turn the power off, though? Mm -hmm. You know, you gotta shut it off before you leave. Is it time for the animals to sleep? Exactly, Sonny. My flashlight won't do the trick. We have night vision goggles? Yeah, bro. We've gotta find the night vision goggles so we can see See what's up. Oh, they're, they're literally right here. Before you leave, I need you to observe the animals. All right, no problem. Make sure they're all living and having fun. Yo, we gotta make sure the animals are having a good time. Let's do this. Turtles. Yep, and I'll investigate the floppa. The turtles look like they're having a nice time. I have a bad feeling, Sonny, one of the animals won't be in the cage. We'll find out, bro. I'm observing the deers. Everything's good there. Penguin is chilling. Foxes? One of them just went inside of the rock, but other than that, they're good. Bears, 
chilling. Hey, Melon, how do I look with my night vision glasses? You look beautiful, Sonny. Thanks, bro. You look pretty cool, too. I know. I look really radical. Ooh, I'll take a look at the tiger. And the tiger's chilling. Ooh, I got really scared, Sonny. I thought the pigeon escaped. That would have been the worst one to get out. I know, bro. And even more dangerous, the parrots. They might start making fun of us and repeat everything we say. Yeah, that would suck. One left. Another big bear. No problem. Yo, I got a badge. The animals are all good. We can leave the zoo now. Are we gonna get the good ending? Are we finally gonna escape one of these games? Yep, I'm leaving, bro. I'm at the main exit. Yep, same here, Sonny. Night one complete. Oh, that was just our first shift. Good work last night. The last worker died due to the tiger. Wait, what? What? Boss man. Besides that, I'm really mad about the ticket booth. Yo, boss, that wasn't us. We told you it was a gust of wind. Fix your act. What? Bro, I wanna kill this boss. Oh, by the way, I left some stuff for the animals. I swear if he makes us look at all the animals again. I need you to place them in the cages. Okay, we'll give those toys off. What are those? I think it's exercise machines. Here we go. I'll grab the obstacles and I'll place these with the animals. One for the snakes. Perfect. I'll handle the bear drop. Where are the other exclamation points? I don't know, bro. Open your eyeballs. I can't find them, Sonny. Oh, I can turn my night vision off now. Yeah, we don't need that. Oh, they're way out here. I got the deer. Can the deers kill you? Nah, we're chilling. Dude, the animals are all friendly. Don't worry about it. Even the bears? Yeah, look. I'm gonna walk right through a bear. Hey, buddy. Don't eat me. Please don't eat me. Yeah, we're chilling. All right. Animals are being chill. Perfect. They need to lose weight. Those animals need to lose weight? Bro, the animals are thick. I should paint the wall. Why are we painting the walls? Yeah, I don't really get an itch to paint like this. I don't know what's going on here. Boss will love it and he'll forgive me. True. We need to earn the boss's respect if we're gonna survive the night shift. Man, this is really far though. That's such a big walk. It's all right. I'll grab the paint from the workers area. Got it. Painting walls. Is it gonna be a good paint? Hey, check it out. The zoo. Nice, bro. I painted a bunch of panda bears with sombreros eating tacos. That's pretty awesome. I think the boss will love this. And the last painting is... Whoa, a toucan and an iguana. And a butterfly. What was that? Wait, what's going on? Not again. Not the ticket booth. No, that wasn't the ticket booth, bro. I think that was one of the animals. Oh, no. It was all of the animals. The cages, they're open. Uh, Sonny, this isn't good. Something just screamed. Follow where the noise came from. Um, Sonny, are you near me? I found the noise. It was near the Floppa exhibit. Uh, Melon, it looks like something bad happened. What? happened here. There's blood. Ew. Whose blood is this? Time to mop it up. Gotta go grab the mop from storage, Sonny. Oh, yes. The workers only area where every item is located. I got that mop, which is really a broom. Kind of worried, though. Like, all these animals are on the loose. The floppa isn't in his cage. Oh, it is. I'm, I'm just blind. Bro, that is the strangest looking floppa ever. Bro, it's like a turtle. True. Anyways, let me clean this mess up. Gone. You look tasty. Ah, what the heck? What is that? Not cool. Not cool. Melon, what do we do? Sonny, Sonny, I thought an animal was going to come after us. What's happening? I'm the haunting echo in your dreams. It's a monster. It's not even an animal. What? This is cursed. I'm going to eat all the animals here. What? You're going to eat the animals? Boss will be so mad. Then everyone who walks in this suit. What? Paint him quick. Including you, the boss, and everyone. What the heck? Oh, no. What is this man? My plan. Is just started. Who is he? Oh no, Sonny. We've got to stop this guy. If it's the last thing we do, we will prevent him from eating our animals. Don't touch the flopper. We need to call 911. Quickly, use the phone. It's in the gift shop. What's your emergency? There's a crazy guy in our zoo. Oh no, they're not going to take us seriously. Yeah, they will, Melon. You're funny. There's no such thing as monsters. It's a totally reasonable story. There's a monster attacking the zoo. Oh, no. You don't understand. They don't believe us. There is. Never call us again. Don't waste our time. What? No. Why? Melon, this is not good. Sonny, the police won't believe us. What if his plan succeeds? Who are we going to turn to now? Will the boss help? Hey, I need you to check up on the animals. Okay, boss. We're on it. All right, boss man. Health checks. Yeah, that seems reasonable. Hello, little snake. I've come to 
perform a health checkup. Oh no, I think he's dead. Uh, Sonny, I think the lion's dead. Let me check on the tiger. And uh, maybe he's just sleeping. He just did a growl. Uh, yeah, he's just sleeping. Yeah, yeah, good idea. He's just snoozing, just taking a big old nap. Sonny, this one's moving over here, so he should be fine. I hope so. This bear is standing up on all of his legs, but he's not. Oh, he's moving. The bear's fine. Let's go. Deer, are you gonna be okay? Stop moving. There we go. Wait, one dead? I think it was the tiger. No. The tiger passed away. And that dang noise, we just heard it again. It was like a pipe exploded. Oh my goodness, dude. Are we really about to fix this pipe? There's a monster on the loose. It's fine. I'll get the wrench. We still have to perform our duties just in case the monster's in our imagination. Now, where's that leaky pipe? All the way over here. Oh dear, Melon. Get it? Because there's a deer near this. I get it. I get it. Great work, bro. You can leave for today. Yes, we did it. Yes. Wait, he's actually congratulating us, the tiger freaking died. Yeah, great work today. <laughs> that makes no sense. But I guess the boss is being understanding that it wasn't our fault. Yeah, but the ticket booth was apparently. Yeah, that kind of makes no sense. Leave through the main entrance. I'm with you, broski. Let's get out of this place. A bad feeling that I'm about to get jump scared. Nah, bro, we're fine. It's night three, hunting for gold. Hey, I'm surprised you're still living. Jeez, I feel like the boss is the monster. Most people usually get eaten by the animals. Yo, wait, what? How many people worked here before us? Anyways, keep up the great work tonight. Dude, something is wrong with our boss. He is evil. Yeah, bro. He, like, has no empathy or something. You got them seeds? I got them seeds, sonny. And now we place them to feed the birds. I'll get the pigeons. I'll get the toucan parrots. I don't really know. Parrots have been fed. Same with the pigeons. What is that sound? No. No, 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 no. What is that noise? Bro, what was that? I have a bad feeling someone got eaten. And I hear someone running away. Where's the cause of this noise. Oh no, Sonny. Sonny, they killed a pigeon! How is that possible? I was just feeding them. No, the poor pigeon. I've got the dead bird. It looks alive to me. Is this the bird we just fed? It is, actually, yeah. Did you kill my bird? No, we did it, boss, I swear! And we'll prove it. Um, okay. Oh yeah, we have cameras. That's actually really smart. What if we check the cameras and you're there possessed, actually trying to eat the bird? Bro, what if he copies one of our skins? No. No. Oh, don't do it. Birds are tasty. This is really creepy. Yeah, that's definitely not us. Hey, you. Guess what? What? There's gold in the tiger exhibit. Check it. No way, Melon. There's gold? There's gold there? We're gonna be rich! Let's go! All of our problems will be behind us if we can just get this gold. Tiger is still dead. We haven't moved its body. We eat the ah! Uh... No, 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 no. I'm pretty hungry. Look at his smile, bro. He's such a weirdo. Dude, this guy. This guy is so creepy. Better start. Running. We can't let him eat the animals. Uh, Sonny, I think he might eat us. I think he might eat us. Where's the gold? Yeah, but where's the gold? Avoid the monster for 15 seconds. I'm dead! Sonny, you fool! What did you do? I can revive. Oh, wait, I got him stuck. The monster's trash. Hold on, I'm coming back to life. Epic. Oh, he almost caught up to me. That was a close one. Sonny, thank goodness for pay to win. I know, otherwise I'd be a goner. Yeah, we need to get the heck out of here, Sonny. Yep, and I never want to come back. But we probably Probably will. Nah, I'm not working another night at this place. I'm done with it. And it's locked, Sonny. It's locked! Are we trapped inside? I don't know. I don't know. Sonny, I feel like the boss is that monster. I really have a strong feeling about it. I agree, bro. I don't like where this is going. I have a feeling when we call him, the monster's gonna show up. Wait, what? How did he eat the phone? And why is the phone bloody? It makes no sense. Just lock the door and stay put. Oh, no. It's chapter four, the animal eater. Day is the day everyone dies. Oh, no. Oh, no, Sonny. No, no, this is creepy. What if we buy an RPG? I don't think it'll work. He's a freaking monster. Mela, look up! Ah! Look up! I'm the carnivore. Oh, no. You're the creepivore. That's what you are. He's terrifying. Uh, how do we get outside? Uh, don't question it. We need to prepare ourselves. We need to lock the animal doors, and we need to use the animals to eat him. Yes, we will unite forces with the snakes, bears, and tigers. I love how I lock this door, but I can still open it. Yes, only we can pass through a locked door. I am securing the door to the deers. Yes, the piggyons shall be secured. Oh, my goodness, Sonny. This last one is far. Uh, we're protecting the snakes. You think that's gonna help? Pathetic. Um, Sonny, where is this guy? I don't know. I'm looking for him. I'm shooting this thing? Yeah, I wish, but I don't have a weapon. Oh, wait. We're about to get one. Let's go. Let's take him down. Wait, Sonny, you just glitched me out of the map. What did you do? Sorry about that. <laughs> 
You stepped in front of me. I was trying to grab the safe. Bro, I'm glitched out of the map. It's all right. I got the gun now. All right. Well, I guess I'm safe. Uh, you have fun, I guess, beating the game. Yep. You found a secret ending. Wait, why is time running out? What is he going to do? I'll be there in 30 seconds. 30 seconds? I got to shoot him. I'm ready for dinner. I'm hiding, I guess. He's ready to feed. Call for help using the radio. Okay, I can do that. Maybe I can get back in there. Oh, I see your flashlight. Yeah, I'm stuck. You're just outside. You're behind the house. You're not getting any help. Oh, you're in this. I see. Maybe you'll be safe. Maybe. I mean, I don't think he's going to be able to get back here. I'm at the front. Don't worry, Melon. I'll be a hero. I'll stop him. You got this, Sonny. I'm heading to the front, and I'm going to blast him! He you is here. You start running. I'm not afraid of you. Try to run, try to fight. Dang right, I'm gonna fight this guy. Let's take him out and save the animals. I can't do either though, I'm stuck. I know, I'll handle this. Oh, welcome back. Wait, what? Where am I? Melon, Melon, you're right! Ah! You may have won the fight, but the war is just getting started. I'm dead. I'm dead too. I got dead ending. Rip, you died to the carnivore. Bro, I didn't even have a chance to see the guy. Oh my goodness. Dang it! Well, we tried, and we got eaten by the carnivore. Well, Sonny, we may have gotten the bad ending, but at least we saved the animals. And if you guys want to save our channel, press that like and subscribe button. Otherwise, you'll end up like this.